Hi, my name is JD and I'm very nice shoot for you. It's going right, X, Valorant, let's go. Agents, artists. Hey, I'm Param and I'm a video editor at Global Esports. Fighting! What you see is a three minute video. What I get is hours and hours of footage. But there's a process even before this that takes days and days of planning and preparation. Imagine, like creators with running room to room. Our team is here to make sure things go smoothly on the shoot day and we don't get any surprises. Our team is working together to transform this place into something entirely different. Something straight out of Valorant. Like this wall. What do you know about today's show? I know there is a red carpet. I know there are posters. Shuru me to like I thought ki thoda ek you know it's like a promotional shoot ki thoda ad type hoga but abhi yahan pe aake dikh raha hai ki ekdam hardcore scenes ho rahe hain. Jaise ki rounds hai, team badges hai, humne dialogues mein kafi sari cheeze notice kari hai. Ek jagah fighting hota hai, ek jagah feel ki baat ho rahi hai to ya samajh mein aa raha hai ki kya chal raha hai. I know everything. कौन सा क्या-क्या reveal कर सकते हैं वो check करना पड़ेगा। I know कि इसका resemblance है थोड़ा, you know, Val Classico को लेके the older matches that they had. तो concept ये है कि recreating all the iconic moments that happened in Indian Valorant scene. We're collaborating with Riot Games and SHUL to create this amazing piece for making waves, and I'm super excited to be a part of it. Live streaming, competition tournaments, ke alawa, these kind of shoots, getting together is uh, it's pretty good every now and then. Yeah. So the crowd that watches Valorant in India is a fair mix of very smart, very nice people. And the very smart one, if they can pick up all the Easter eggs that are there in this video, I'm sure BTS video will talk about it. But if they pick it up on the main video, then I will be super happy. So you will see posters dekhenge, which look like newspaper parchments. And these are all references to some of the most iconic moments, characters and events in the Indian Valorant community. Best of the rest, who have been failed to reach here? You're talking about Tariq. Let's go quickly, guys. We're going to go to the exam. Let's go! Let's go! And my personal favourite is this moment from SCS Chennai land when Suki from Global Esports basically hijacked the event. He brought in a drum crew and started banging the drums before the final map began. Aryaman and Suki exchanged each other's team flags and they started dancing. And then also everyone else around them started dancing. It was the most wholesome moment in Indian Valorant. For the Global HQ, it was a wake-up call that India is also a region where not just players are. There are so many fans who are taking so much energy in a land tournament. And that's where we really saw the G fighting spirit. What's the most iconic Valorant Classic moment? For them, it was like almost on the peak. You know, but they didn't see what's on the other side. For us, we what's the other side we saw in the end. So unfortunately, VLT was a left right of the week. But that was it. In 9-3, we were full hyped up that 9 rounds. I don't think I've ever felt that much adrenaline pumping for anything else. It was just absolutely amazing. After winning, Rossi won the hand slam on the table. That was my favorite. Lot of mixed emotions, you know. I think Valorant has a special place in our heart, especially for the owners as well, because that's a game that we play very actively as well. India has such a big player base in Valorant. In India, there are creator events in Riot. In India, there are lands. And now, there's a league. 
Riot has been very different to work with in the sense that they really understand what our problems are. The channel of communication has been very open and they've been great at taking feedback. We had faith that League of Legends, which has Riot Games, they will probably do it in Valorant. I don't think anyone has ever done it in India. Riot has been very different to work with in the sense that Secondly, I want to see the Hall of Fame reaction. Guys, this is the Hall of Fame, right? So I want to see this reaction. Oh, dude, I was blown away. What else could you be? I actually knew exactly what was going to happen, but seeing it in person was very different. So, I saw it here, it was good because in real, in person, I saw it and painting, painting, it was good. How do you think this relationship with GE is going to help the whole ecosystem? Wow, so first of all, it's been a crazy journey the last three years doing everything that we've done, come from where we've come and really, you know, climb the ladder to get to where we are. It's really difficult to put uh, three years of hard work that everyone has put in uh, into perspective. I would say it was the right balance of uh, the competitive spirit and content that really, uh, you know, brought our region into attention. And I think that's the reason we got a chance mila to apply uh, for the league slot. An Indian brand representing India at such a big stage. Being able to compete at the highest level, that itself is a big deal for us. So we feel really proud that we're able to make this happen. This is the highest level of competition where you should be. Where that slot is going to be worth millions of dollars in the next coming years. I think it's a huge boost for the Indian esports scene as a whole. This is the current generation with Rossi and Golu. We are hoping to have the next generation come out where we can have more Indian representation, more athletes. For the people or for young generation who starts playing Valorant on a competitive basis, they now know the benchmark where they should end up. Then we have to work very actively with the entire community to ensure that the Indian talent from our region get enough representation at the Pacific League. It won't be a surprise in the end we see like 5-10 players playing at the international stage. As long as you're working in the right direction, I'm sure we're going to make it. Now the progress is showing and now the progress is showing. Now that time has come, the next gen has come. So yeah, it's a very inspirational story. I think people will look up to it and... For many years, you know, it's going to be a church. Yeah, it's a very inspirational story. Yeah, it's a very inspirational story. Yeah, it's a very inspirational story. So with regards to the work put in, of course, the entire team has worked so hard. And then we had a lot of challenges, including finding a location, finding the right cast, and then putting all this together. Just unbelievable being able to put this out in such a short time span. I gotta give props to the rest of the team. Should I start? Cut, cut, cut. Cut, cut, cut. In this particular shoot, pe, I was unfortunately uh, not in uh, India for that. So we were hoping our timelines, uh, you know, kind of match because the film's end portion was in shoot in Korea. Mein hona tha. The day or the night that I was leaving, that day uh, Golu and Rossi arrived as they were, you know, literally reacting to the city and I could see their faces light up. You're in Seoul, you're literally in the most beautiful or the mecca of esports. But it was a good thing because it was a very raw emotion to be captured. And somehow, I guess it all fit in. एक छोटा सा clip ना या एक छोटा सा creator भी क्यों ना हो मतलब मैं ad films और movies की बात नहीं कर रहा हूँ छोटा सा creator भी क्यों ना हो वो अपना best करता है उस clip पे ये अपना best effort जितना means है जो resource है उसके साथ वो अपना best put off करता है the least you can do is support them. One day ad set has taught me so much more about what it takes to bring a film come to its life. It's a combined effort and hard work of so many people that go unnoticed. Me being in on the on the stage of VCT Pacific, I feel like I did something to be here. There's a bigger stage, bigger risk, bigger opportunity. It all started from doing what you love, loving what you do. Abhi G B a family ban gaya sabka. Now we have a bigger challenge ahead, which is uh, the Pacific League, or you can say the highest level of competition jidhar hota hai international league. It will be a hard challenge. It will take a lot of grind. We'll we'll make it through. This is a better opportunity for 
us to show the entire world that India is a very competitive region in esports as well. I can make my country proud and the others uh, watching me proud. I can make my family proud just being on the stage where uh, I hold the power to do it. I'm really glad that you know maybe a moment may maybe a part two and I want to be the first guy to you know leave a huge mark on the international stage and I'm in that position and I have a really good opportunity and really good people around me to make that possible. So yeah, keep supporting all the players, all the teams. Uh, let's make our country proud.